Hi, this is Alex Michael with the thriftycouple.com and today I'm going to show you how easy it is, extremely easy it is to install WordPress. I'm using Bluehost and I'm in the control panel. If you're using your own host, you should be able to go in into your own control panel and see the same type of op option. But as you scroll down, you're going to see right here install WordPress. It's going to be crazy just how easy this is to install it. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And as you do it yourself, WordPress, the latest version, 4.5.1, I'm going to go ahead and click on install. You probably saw the other paid options. You don't need those. Um, I'm going to go ahead and install it on what they say is my root directory. I'm not going to have any other directories um, underneath it, but I'm going to install it onto my uh, domain, cheapdiapersandwipes.com. And so as we're going through this, it's checking to make sure that there's no other WordPress installs there. Um, I would recommend as, as you get to this point that you would click on the advanced options, that you would put your site name there, but that's not what I am really going to try to recommend. The admin username. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just rename it Cheap Diapers. There's a lot of vulnerabilities with uh, WordPress, and one of the biggest vulnerabilities is using the default username. So go ahead and just put in something else there, so you can make sure that you are um, you're going to be a lot less vulnerable to a lot of the different attacks out there. And then password. By the time that you see this, I will have already changed it, but that's the password it gives me right there. So I'm going to go ahead and say I have read the terms and conditions because uh, I know what that says and I'm going to go ahead and install it. And so it's going to take a couple minutes. It's going, it's getting the WordPress install. It's putting it into the right directory. Uh, this is just going to give you some different offers because they're obviously trying to sell you some things. Um, but it's going to go ahead here across the top, tell you exactly where the details of your install is. And uh, we'll be done in here just a minute. You can click on the details if you like, but uh, really, again, it's just a matter of just waiting for it to install. And then once we have this installed, we'll be able to go in, we'll be able to uh, log into the back end and uh, see what it looks like, but more importantly, be able to know and confirm that it's all it's good to go. So let's go ahead and view the credentials. And I'm going to go ahead and go to cheapdiapersandwipes.com. And you can type in wp slash, wp slash uh, dash admin. And what you're going to see here is it's going to take you to a login screen. And this is where you're going to put that username that you had uh, selected. This is where you're going to put the password. And take a look at this. You right now have just installed WordPress by one click. I'm going to go ahead and click over to the actual site. It looks ugly, but we're going to take care of that in some other videos coming up. So as you scroll down, this is your WordPress install, and you're good to go. I hope that uh, you've enjoyed this. Please feel free to leave a comment below and ask any questions you might have, and I'll try to get back to you as well. Thank you.